Hey guys, Chuck Goss, Westside, Michigan, master of Tuppy Tuppy. Uh, getting good response out of the last couple videos, talking about uh, your intent, what the real purpose behind the technique was with uh, entering, sweep stroking, etc. Um, today, uh, I'm going to show you why hitting with the stick works. Um, and uh, I'm going to show you one uh, abanico technique, but the professor used to use this uh, the striking all the time, and uh, you'll see it's pretty effective. Um, and he's going to help me. I'm not going to hit real hard just so I can talk, and I'm going to go slow so we can go through it, and then I'll show you regular speed. Okay, uh, left versus right, tapi tapi. Um, you know, off the bat, you're going to hit. Again, good sweep stroke with intent. Uh, we're not wearing protective gear, so I'm going to go a little shorter so I don't knock him out. But utilizing the same information that was on the last video. Okay, step four. That's it. So I have intent there. Now when this comes, I'm going to hit, hit, and present and hit. You see, now I can thrust or punch and hit again, see? If I want, I have short trap, or I can push and hit again. Then I have the dummy lock, or I can take his teeth, whatever you want to do there. Okay, but the key here is, is remember, your intent with your sweep stroke is to hit him. If he doesn't move out of the way, these guys that want to stand their ground, let them stand their ground. Have your intent. In a real fight, you're going to knock him backwards. He's going to move out of the way. Most people aren't going to stand there and take that hit. They're going to move. When they move, you're setting up for the stick strike. Okay, along the arm, waist, leg, whichever you like. Okay, I like going to the waist and cutting through, and then I'll hit the hand on the other side. I'll show you both sides of that so you see it. So again, I come in, bang, bang, I hit. See, now I'm here, I hit. When I hit that, I roll that over and hit again. I can thrust here, I can punch here. Okay, you're gonna punch. In real, you'd be punching to the face. If he's lucky enough to block it, okay. As he goes, the timing is, is as he's reaching for it, the stick's gonna hit him, here. Now I can clear that hand to do abanico and knock that back out and hit again or punch again. And then here, you'd really clock him. Okay, change sides. Okay. So again, so you see the hit on this side. That's the only reason why we're changing sides. My intent is to hit him. I move his, his position. I go, boom, I hit. Now I'm going to hit, hit, and I'm going to force this in so he has to block. If he comes towards my face, punch instead. I'm just going to hit that and thrust. Okay, but again, I force this in, he touches, I'm going to hit, and then hit. Now I can punch to the face. See, now I can hit that again. Here I have short trap and punch again, or I have the open leg for a kick, okay? Right here, boom, okay? So, you have those, practice those at home, go slow, don't punch your partner in the face, okay? All right, thanks a lot for watching.